Aloha, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to prepare the green drink for the Cleanse and Rejuvenate class. I started making this green drink and drinking it back in the 1990s, about 25 years ago. I felt like I needed a little extra nutrition and I was really sold on the spirulina, chlorella, green magma, and the green grass powders. Wheatgrass at the time was in juice form, but you know, you just couldn't get it everywhere. So we got the powder, we started putting it together in the green drink package, and that's what I use as my foundation. So let's get going and I'll show you how to make a green drink. It's a simple one, and then I'll show you a little bit more of a deluxe version that I use. The first thing we want to do is we want to get two good lemons. These are Meyer lemons grown here on Maui. All the produce that I'm going to be using is going to be organic, local, and fresh. Fresh picked as soon as I can. So we'll take a lemon and we'll squeeze that little lemon right into here, put it on the, the reamer, get all that good juice, put it out into, into a compost. Compost. I love my compost. I use my compost and I'll show you in another video on how to use vegetable scraps for making soup stock. So, getting these lemons going. Now, why am I using lemons? Well, Lemons are an incredible food for the liver. It actually helps digestion. It's, acidic, it's acid, it's acidic. So what it does is it actually helps stimulate the hydrochloric acid in the stomach so things can be broken down, digested, and absorbed. So I now have my lemon juice, which I will now strain out the seeds as I pour it into a little cup. And we'll make that like that. And put a little clean finger in, stir it up a little bit, get some good of my own good microbiome in there. Take that, move it out of the way. Now I have a nice clean fresh bottle, which I will then pour in my lemon juice. And there she goes. Beautiful. I just love lemons. So you see what two lemons can yield you. Now I'll take a little of good maple syrup, organic kind. Put a little bit in, just enough to make it, just enough, that's probably around two tablespoons, just enough to make it flavorful so I don't get to too much of a tart. If you want the tart, fine, don't add the maple syrup. If you do want a little bit of sweetener, either maple syrup or lehua or manuka honey. Now I'm going to put in some chlorophyll. The chlorophyll is by far so incredible. I mean, it's, whew, what can I say? helps oxygen transport, it increases red blood cell production, it cleanses the blood, it cleanses the liver, it cleanses the lymphatic system. Chlorophyll is the, the blood of the plant. It's just basically one molecule away from being human blood. So I'm going to pour some in. That's about, ooh, I'll say two tablespoons, some nice rich chlorophyll, and give it a little shake to some maximum B complex. Now, B-complex, I added into this because I wanted it for my nervous system and for my liver and to help calm me down. So I'll put, mm, that's about a teaspoon of B. Now I'm going to take some magnesium, which also has other nutrients in it, sodium. This one, this one here has sodium and magnesium, potassium, and some calcium. So with this, this is usually eight drops. So one, two, three. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. We got eight drops of a magnesium solution. Now I'm going to add some trace minerals. Trace minerals is a good long story about cell food from Dr. Everett's story from the 1940s who invented this. These are trace minerals, and they're called trace because you only need a trace of them. So the directions on this says eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We'll just maybe give or take a drop. And then I'm going to add into the simple green drink. Da -dum, da dum about a tablespoon of the powder. Okay, that's a good rounded tablespoon. So, simple green drink. Now all I have to do to that is add some good water. Now water is important to this, and water is important for all of us, obviously, because we're 70 to 80% water content. Water is life. But there's so many things about water, which I'll talk about during the course. This is an alkaline water. Sometimes you can use a reverse osmosis filtered water, maybe a distilled water. Sometimes spring water from a spring is great, but I can't, I don't have a spring available, so I use the alkaline water. And we'll just pour some alkaline water. I'm only going to fill it up halfway because I'm going to add on to this the deluxe version. 
There's your simple green drink. This is entry level. It's great. No problem with it. It will take you a long way. But I like to add a little boost into mine. I like to give it a little booster. This is vitamin D3. And with this, I'm going to put in five drops of vitamin D3, which is equivalent to 5,000 international units. One, two, three, four, and five. Good. Well, that was actually six. Just one for good measure. Some vitamin E. I like vitamin E. I'm going to add eight drops of vitamin E to this. And let's see, I think I'll do it with an eyedropper. That's always fun to use. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight drops. Eight drops of vitamin E. Now, what I like to do for mine is a little bit extra B12. Being a vegetarian, I like to have some extra B12. I don't want to get involved in any kind of pernicious anemia, so I will use my B12. And in this, I'm going to use a quarter teaspoon, quarter teaspoon, and bingo, that's a quarter teaspoon in my book. So in goes that. Now I'm going to use iodine. This is liquid kelp. And I like this because of the iodine factor. It's extremely alkalizing, and that's really an important thing. Iodine, kelp, one. Two, three, four, and five drops of kelp. And in she goes. Now, what I like to do is I'm going to put some GSE, which is known as grapefruit seed extract. And I use 10 drops of this because this is antiparasitic, antifungal, antibacterial. It's also real good for the gut, and it cleans things. It keeps things nice and shiny clean. 10 drops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And one for good measure. And this is, last but not least, this is a silica formula. Silica is so important for the body. It's the most predominant mineral on the planet. So we're going to use the silica. And in this, I'm just going to use 10 drops. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Bingo. Now, in the super deluxe formula, which is I'm using, instead of using one tablespoon, I'm going to use another one. So I like a little bit extra green because I like to sip on this all day long. So I'll put another tablespoon of green drink powder into that. What I'll do now is just fill up the rest of the jar and with good water. And there we go. Put the top on. Give it some good shakes. I like to shake with it. Might as well get my energy moving with it. Bingo. I now have my green drink. This is my super deluxe green drink that I drink. You can make your own. You know the formula. We just went through it. This is going to give you the energy you need to sustain you through the day. Actually, this green drink, you can fast on this and get all the nutrition you need. You're going to get the fluids. You're going to get your nutrition. You're going to get your antioxidants. You're going to get your antifungal, antibacterial. This stuff is what I like to fast on. Um, actually, it's not really a fast. It's to drink. I'm just going to be drinking this. I'll do a, maybe a three to five day diet on this. But I drink one of these every day. This is the stuff. Okay. Thank you very much. Enjoy.